Okay, this is our objective for today to translate verbal praise to mathematical praise. And we have some keywords to use in translating verbal praise to mathematical praise or mathematical expression. Okay, we have the basic operations in math. We have the plus, minus, times, and divide. Okay, now these are the keywords. Uh, addition plus increased by added to the sum of more than total we use plus sign we use the minus sign if we encounter the following words subtraction minus decrease by subtracted from the difference of diminished by and less than okay and we're going to use the times sign or the multiplication sign if we encounter the word multiplication times multiplied by and the product of okay and we use the symbol of division if we encounter the word division divided by ratio of the quotient of Okay, and now how do we write the verbal phrases and the mathematical phrases using the keywords? Okay, before that, let's define first what is addition, subtraction, multiplication, and division. Addition would indicate an increase, a putting together, or combining. Subtraction would indicate lessening, diminishing action. Multiplication would indicate multiplying action. And division would indicate partitioning a quotient and a ratio. Okay, we have an example number one. A number increased by two. In this example, we're going to use plus sign because of the word increase by. And then we're going to change the word a number to the variable x. In this example, the answer is x plus two. Okay, let's have an example number 2. A number n added to 3. Okay, if we're going to translate, a number n is n. And then we're going to use plus sign because of the word added to. Then we have 3. So we have n plus 3. Okay, so let's have this one. 7 multiplied by a number. So, 7 means we have the number 7. And then, multiplied means we're going to use the symbol of multiplication. And then, we're going to uh, change the word and number to a variable. So, which is letter A. Then, we have 7 times A. Okay, next. Twice the product of 3 and X. Okay, twice means two times and then the product of means we're going to use the symbol of multiplication the product of 3 and x we have 3 times x twice so we have now the answer 2 times 3 times x okay next a number n divided by 4 so, in this example, we're going to use the symbol of division because of the word divided by. So, a number n, which is letter n, over 4. So, n over 4 or n divided by 4. The next number 2. The quotient of x and 2. So, again, we're going to use the symbol of division because of the word quotient of. So, therefore, the answer is x over 2. Okay, so let's have the following activity. Write the following verbal phrase to mathematical phrase. Okay, good luck. So, sana po may naitulong po itong video na to sa inyo. So, may mga lesson pa po akong na-upload na before. So, at marami pa po akong i-upload. So, sa mga gusto pong uh, ma-update sa mga videos ko, sa mga lessons ko, please click nyo lang po yung subscribe, the like, and the bell button para ma-notify po kayo pag nag-upload po ako. Thank you! Or search nyo lang po ang YouTube channel ko, Matish.